Hey guys, you're watching Cartoon Block. My name is Jake Casarina. We're here at Warner Brothers Animation today, and I'm going to draw for you guys Batman using his Hammers of Justice. Okay, boys and girls, we're starting off with the main idea, and that is a bat punch. Concept, Batman using his hammers of justice on a bad guy. Don't worry, he's not dead. He's just going for a nice long sleep. Oh, news. All right, the thumbnail process is one of my favorite parts of uh, drawing for you guys. And basically what it is, is finding the best pose to deliver the best bat punch. And, of course, making it cool for you guys. So there's thumbnail one, and all thumbnails are just really quick drawings, uh, again, just to get a very basic shape and a very basic pose for the drawing. And then, of course, we make it epic and awesome later on. Drawing the little bad guy there. Let's get one more. Yeah. And I think we're going to go with number two. Okay, so what I did, I uh, roughed it, I, I did a really loose gesture is what we call it in the animation. And what I'm doing here is taking that gesture and refining it a little bit more. And we call this the roughing stage. Now what I'm doing is I'm just finding the basic shapes, basic uh, features on a character. And uh, in this case, I'm drawing the crook getting punched in the face. Gotta have the back cape. Okay, now what I'm doing, um, uh, this could be considered a second part of the roughing phase, or it could even be called um, pre-cleanup or even uh, tightening up a bit more. Um, it's an extra step, and uh, some artists do and some artists don't. I tend to like to do it more. Um, and just basically, again, finding out where everything goes at on Batman's body, finding out where the knees go, the legs go, the calves, the feet, all the good stuff. Mapping out the villain's face, going to put the villain's head on model. Just a little bit, again, roughing it out, finding that shape, getting the best possible drawing I can for you guys to look at later on. Fixing the head a little bit. And here's the great thing about digital is I can uh, select, I can redo, undo, I can rotate cameras, I can do tons of great stuff in digital animation nowadays, and, and it just really helps you get a better overall product. So now what I'm doing is the cleanup phase. This is the final phase of the of the drawing and animation. And what that is is giving it a clean line. One or two lines per little uh, object on Batman. Here we go. Drawing out his torso. Getting his utility belt in there. And getting his feet. You gotta have the bat symbol. I had to go in and draw the bat symbol. Because without that, it's not Batman. Drawing his fist for you guys, fleshing it out a little bit more. Let's see. Now we clean up the feet. On to the bad guy. Again, doing some uh, final cleanup on the bad guy. One line here, one line there, making it a very clean, pristine drawing for you guys to get the overall best read for you. Now, in animation, we tend to go a mile a minute, and we tend to do a lot of drawings in a very short amount of time, so it's very easy to forget something, and in this case, I forgot the bad guy's body. Not recommended. So what I did, I went back and I uh, fleshed it out real quick, roughed it out, gestured, and then now I'm doing the cleanup stage. And don't worry, I'm not drawing this fast in real time. Through the uh, magic of editing videos, we can make it look like I can draw just like the Flash. Because, you know, all superheroes tend to draw really fast. And here we are coming up on the finishing touches of the overall drawing. Add some uh, bow lines and maybe pepper with a little black dots. Thanks for watching and see you next time. To see more of Jake's artwork, visit his website at jakeart.weebly.com.